what they're trying to do is you know reel them in a little bit and make them understand a little bit better the objective of team play and sharing the basketball Phillips off the mark and here comes Davis well there's some energy on the reverse although is Ricky Davis the type of player even though you can question the shot selection and some of the decisions that he makes not effective unless he is playing with high energy. Look, no one has ever questioned the athletic ability of Ricky Davis. What they question is his understanding of the game, his willingness to share the basketball and play within a team concept that helps you to win games. They shot very well at 52% from the field, led by James with 19. Boozer has 18. Here's James putting it up there. Oh, what a play! Darius Miles from LeBron James. Foul was called on Bim. Here's Davis. Get the idea following that reverse stuff. Ricky Davis working his way back into this one. Cleveland Cavaliers are shooting 55%. Their season high is a 52% game. Here's Davis adding to that percentile. Cavaliers have their biggest lead of the night, up by 11. Okor. And the Meadow Okor is now one of five from the field. James is stopped. Stopped by Hamilton, but a beautiful look. James to Boozer, and the Cavaliers now lead 75-61. Unselfishness and great passing are infectious. The crowd on their feet here, their teammates showing the energy and excitement that Paul Silas says isn't there all the time. And it all starts with an 18-year-old giving up the basketball rather than trying to score the basketball. Well, Phillips rejected by Stewart. It's a four-on-one. Davis puts it down. Nice pass from Miles. It's almost like, you know, you want to say to Phillips, where were you going with that shot? Because he wasn't really at the top or peak of his jump, and there's a shot blocker standing right there in front of you. So what were you intending on doing that particular time? Well, Yogi Stewart can block shots. We know that. He has great anticipation. And if they can block shots, Cleveland has so much athleticism. When they're in the open floor, it's going to be a dunk. And Ricky Davis has come on now. 13 points. James played by Phillips. Miles met by Prince. Got a hand on it. Recovered by Davis. And Ricky Davis with 13 points the last 12 minutes. And you called it, Mark. When he made that reverse dunk on the fast break, all of a sudden his energy was sky high. He's a guy who feeds off of scoring. Williamson is fouled by Stewart. And a timeout call. Well, the one thing that you've noticed this game, his shots are high percentage shots. There haven't been that many wild ones out of control. He'll finish that and take it every time. Seven-point game now here, so exactly what Paul Silas talked about. Can they finish a game? Brooks has 11. LeBron James, yes. Cavaliers 87, Pistons 78. We're just under four remaining in this fourth quarter. Marv Albert with the czar, Mike Fratello, Steve Kerr, and Craig Sager. We're in Cleveland, Ohio. LeBron James and the Cavs. Extend the lead, a fadeaway by James to give his Cavaliers an 89, a 78 advantage. He made the shot, but it still was not a good shot at that time. They could get a better one. And an offensive foul on Prince. That's his third. Well, it may not have been a great shot, at least execution-wise, but that's a big shot. And that's what superstar players have to do. Make big shots in situations where their team is trying to win a game. And that was impressive. 2.45 remaining of the fourth. Cavaliers looking to hold on for a precious victory. That was not a good pass by James. Three on two. James with the rejection. 
this crowd responds. Well, the pass may not have been a good pass a couple seconds before, but the youngster comes right back and makes up for it by saving two points with the rejection.